everyone welcome to my channel and today I'm going to do a mini album share of my December daily 2017 I am so excited because this is the first time I'm going to do a December daily and the first time maybe and hopefully that I will have to carry a journal with me everywhere this month and without further ado let us start with the cover so first and foremost when I started to plan about my December daily I wanted a wreath kind of thing on my cover so I made a mold from my Martha Stewart um, silicone mold that I got last year I painted it with green nail polish and then after that I also painted it with glittery nail polish thus it doesn't focus thus the glittery effects and I think it's so Christmassy and for the ribbon I have this from my stash an old ribbon I made it myself and then to secure it I sew it on the back so that this when you pull this off it won't go anywhere because this will be in my bag and I don't want to tie this little little ribbon every day <laughs> so I printed December daily on a parchment and then cut it off in this size and backed it also with a scrap page of this album and that's the translucent effect behind so the reds are those lights and this red snowflake is not very very vivid and underneath is for leaves there is one odd leaves these leaves are kind of felt I, it is felt made of felt cloth and then the edge kind of have this darkening and I think it's so Christmassy they are leftovers from the giveaways I had from my wedding <laughs> And then this 2017 characters, I printed off the inter the internet on my printer and then I cut it around, I fussy cut everything, it's so tedious. But after that, I placed some glue and sprinkled glitters all over. But glue and glitters does not really stay put for long, it will scatter everywhere in my bag or somewhere else. So I placed some glossy accents on top to secure them down plus it adds some shininess instead of work. <laughs> okay, and then for the cover, I always like my um, books to be hard bound. So good thing I have my son's milk boxes. <laughs> I recycle them and make them into um, uh, albums and journals. And then I covered it with crumpled a newsprint thus the crumply crumply effect and then I brushed it with red acrylic paint but because of the crumpledness crumpledness <laughs> I have sparse places of whites and then after that I also get a crumpled paper and then I dab it with green acrylic paint and then I dab it everywhere and then I also got darker green and also dab it everywhere back and front so on the side is two um, eyelets on top to secure the book the pages and then over here also but then I messed up making this eyelet so this hole is here <laughs> uh, but to cover that up I would like to place here something like Merry Christmas or whatever I can find but I forgot prior to filming <laughs> And then for the closure, my closure is kind of weird, weird kind of complicated, I guess, if you look at it. My sister complained, <laughs> but for me, it's just fine. So I want something that can hold this book. When I add some things here, I know that it will open much bigger um, because I like to add photos in my albums. And then on the back is two eyelets and I secured that uh, in the back page and then I have it close over here and so I have here four eyelets and this one's for holding it down and this one is for the closure itself and when I open this now I untie the ribbon and pull pull this one here but not entirely I will leave some things here so that I it will not be so hard to 
to uh, to tie it back later on. And then when you open that, tada! The first page. I left this one blank because I don't know what else or what code will I place in here. So it will be placed as soon as I can find something perfect for my album. The papers here, the, these papers, the background ones, are digital papers that I got from here, Etsy, from the seller. And I have this paper printed maybe two years back because I wanted to have a December daily back then but I cannot because I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> but my ephemeras are, I just downloaded them from Google and then printed off my printer and ta-da! <laughs> I hope I did not cross legalities about pages that I print because I don't know. Moving on is I have here um, three ephemeras, three journaling pages, a postcard with two elves kissing so cute they like they like they were like wearing christmas trees and more ephemeras here and maybe i will place some writings or realizations or quotes here i plan to put a picture here and journal in here so i can also place photo in here and this is a pocket for my ephemeras and this pocket is made up of bond paper stronger ones than normal and i punched it with my um, we are memory keepers doily maker and then a little cute snowman with a bell with a hat and with a scarf with cute buttons <laughs> it looks like a bear but he's a snowman and i fussy cut out him and place him there and behind him are snowflakes that I also handmade from a puncher that I had back when I don't know how to scrapbook yet but I had the puncher so I punched it and then placed some glue and glitters on top but this time I did not put glossy accents on them because I had no time <laughs> I'm busy <laughs> and on the next page I left this one blank and this one has a green metallic um, paper clip and then some journaling places, postcards, music sheet, and you can journal at the back, Put some photos in here, and I also printed them off the Google. And on the next page, also left blank, and then in here is another pocket with an ephemera. This is the cute Mary and Joseph with Jesus because that is what Christmas is all about, you know, originally. <laughs> and then a folder that I made out of my scrap folders. By the way, these pages are stronger because they are made up of folders, like this kind of folders. So that will go in here and also this one and a doily again of bond paper doily and then some snowflakes and some cute stuff in here bells and this one this frame is from my stash that I already have and I have here a brown piece of board because whenever I have a picture to be placed in here I just trace it down and then slide it in here and so I will not have a hard time measuring the frame because I already have this one and then I can journal in here and here is a belly band which is foiled I hope you can see that because it's so pretty and again ephemeras handmade tags and the next page I left this one blank without any ephemeras because I can place something in here but I left it blank because I wanted to put a photo and so that behind that will be this cute snowflakes again and then pocket with music sheet away in the manger and by the way these papers are sticker paper and these ones are also so printed on a sticker paper because it's easier because I will not place double-sided tape and I will not place glue or scotch tape or whatever to adhere it will adhere beautifully so that would be that 
And here are some gimmicky stuff that I make. Um, it's just an eyelet hole with something hanging, like a tag. And then I can place something in here like a coat, whatever. And here is a reindeer pocket. She's so pretty, he or she. And then some ephemeras, long ones and square ones. Place that back in there. The next page is a postcard with a pink metallic clip. Photo in here, journal in here, photo in here. Yay, so pretty. And then the next page again is another one of this die cut from the line of this frame. And then as a pocket also with this one Christmas bring joy and peace bring you joy and peace and then another music sheet like can journal on the back on the next page is another pocket because I wanted this out on top so many pockets because I don't I like to place things in here and then two ephemeras again here is one of my favorite pages because I don't know it's just so pretty to look at then there are two tabs in here I, which I punched a EK success puncher or scalloped ones also like here from my scraps and then journaling pages it is and then I close place them back here and here because for the love of parchment paper I place it down there because it, it looks it just looks so cute to be translucent see and then I placed some snowflakes with glitters and then an ephemera that I totally stick that down and this cute ticket it just makes everything cute. I just remember this. Yay! Next page, left blank for photos. And this page is a pocket also with a bond paper doily and some things. And this ticket is just so cute and snowflakes again and this one is a notebooky thing or a card it says christmas prayer because i will place my christmas prayer here <laughs> and i placed it down here by the way i kind of roughly counted my pages that i will have two um days like in here Two days here, two days here, two days here, or I just made extra pages for Christmas Day because we take a lot of pictures on Christmas Day. And hopefully I will not run out of pages or I can place this Christmas prayer somewhere else, wherever December 25 will be at. And so on the next page is a belly band again which does not reach on the side i place i wanted to place something here but i don't know as of now and i also have two ephemeras here oh this one i want to talk about this this does not really go on my theme um but it's so me it's a pizza christmas tree <laughs> with pizza boxes as gifts it's so me because I love pizza, pizza it's laugh. So that still goes in there. And this one says peace on earth. Another page of postcards. Card because it's the only one. And place that back in here with a green. And then a blank page again. And here is another foiled belly band with ephemeras oh i forgot to put something and on the next page is i kind of salvaged this page because the digital paper that i placed here is kind of the same with this here I, I mean it's really the same but it they don't go too far from each other so i and also here on the next page it's they're so close so i wanted to cover that so i placed this um a music sheet and then I made it into a pocket that has a tab that goes up like this so this is a mini postcard with a pull tab yay I covered my mistake <laughs> and then on the next page is another ephemeras pinned down with a paper clip 
I love this one, they are metallic. And then another uh, ephemera of Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, and a card <laughs> that I can journal into. And then I'll place it back like this. And then on the next page is a pocket. Mrs. Santa Claus and Santa Claus in here. And then there's a pocket with two ephemeras. I like this one also, though it's not really go that's not really go on the theme. But it's so pretty. A girl carrying a Christmas tree is so cute. <laughs> Place that back. This is just a plain page, and in this is another one of those favorite pages that I have. That is with a pocket parchment paper. I have a pull tab here and square ones that I can journal into. And I fussy cut um, sand. Ah! Ah! I fussy cut it Santa Claus and place some handmade snowflakes behind him and then a snowflake also here and I placed a cute um, ticket in here I just like to look at it because it's just so cute for me <laughs> and here is the last page is kinda library pocket but in here I have a envelope parchment envelope that I also made and it is filled with a handmade countdown December 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 um, some are having it only up to the Christmas but I had the, it until December 31 because it is Christmas until January in the Philippines honestly speaking it is Christmas when Burr month starts so yes and I will place that back in here so I will place those on the pages corresponding on what day it is so if this is December 1 in here I'll just place it somewhere here December 1 that I'll just show you December 1 to indicate that this page is December 1 and maybe if I have December 2 on this page I'll just place December 2 in this maybe this maybe this I'm not sure whenever my photos, whatever my photos or my ephemeras or my further journaling stuff will require me. So for the meantime, this will be in here. So whenever I need them and I bring this book with me, is it's just easy to find them. And that is the last page. And what else can I speak to you about? Maybe I will also be posting December daily with photos flip through so that you'll see what I come up into and if ever I will add some ephemeras because these are just in case ephemeras but whenever I will add I'm open to adding some more things in here. So that would be it for this video and I hope you enjoyed watching despite the length and because <laughs> I talk too much. I hope you stay tuned for more videos. Click that subscribe button and the notification thing <laughs> and I will see you soon on my next videos. Bye!